so hello everyone today i'm going to show you how you can fix this unmatch edit page preview and the fusion preview so you can see there is a small difference uh, between fusion and edit page so how to fix this so i'm using assets color space transform so if you don't know how to use assets then i will recommend you to watch that tutorial first i will put the link in the description you can watch that thing the problem of this thing is like uh it is overlapping your alerts okay so if i go to my clips so you can see that i'm using using a color space transform to make the exr image to rec 709 so that's why it is looking like that so actually why this things happens okay why there is a color difference between these two okay so the reason number one is mm, because it was overlapping your alert and your color space okay so what is happening like in the fusion tab it is using the preview alert okay the fusion tab which is uh, given by davinci resolve so it is using this alerts okay so if i turn this thing off it will be default to your exe sequence okay so and if you enable this thing it will uh, apply the LUT on this thing fusion LUT, and it will be look closer to your main one okay but it is not mm, correct so you can see there is a color difference between these two like if i like this this two it is more uh, gamma the gamma of this thing is brighter like you can see the face light and in this one you can see it is dark so actually what is happening and how to fix this so if you want to fix this you need to just add a access transform you have to just write a c e c uh, a c e s access transform so it will be look like this and what is happening like it is now overlapping your access transform to your LUT. okay so what you need to do you have to turn off your LUT, and then you have to copy this setting okay 1.3 cg rec 709 okay and then you will see that your edit page and the fusion tab will be look similar but now your edit page is not looking like that okay so if you go to your fusion tab you have to just turn off this node okay so when you turn off this node your edit page will look right but your fusion will not look right okay so how to work with these things okay um, the solution that i get is like when you're working in fusion what you have to do you have to just turn on this node like this node and you can work on this thing in fusion and when you're done with uh, working in fusion what you have to do you have to just turn off this node and then you can go to your edit page and you can do whatever you want to do your sound effect anything and this thing will be applied to your color space also but when you're working in fusion what you have to do just you have to just go to that node and you have to just turn on that node okay so this thing is only applicable on assets so i will recommend you to watch that uh tutorial first that i recommend before or else it will be not useful for you okay so that's it thank you for watching